Hey guys, uh, this is Jack, and welcome to another Safari 5 video. Um, yesterday it just wasn't available, so I didn't. I was kind of unsure whether to do, to do a video on it or not. And today it is available, so Safari 5, um, there are extensions. And what you're looking at is a page of extensions. There's multiple places on the web that you can browse to. You can search up on uh, Bing or Google. I'm using Bing right now because it's just a change. It's different from what I've been using before. Well, anyway, um, I'm using Bing and... Uh, you know, you can hate or like it or whatever, or, or neither. And I searched up a few, you know, I searched up Safari extensions and, uh, oops. And uh, I got this page here, like, you know, like Mashable, you can find uh, basically um, repositories or basic collections of all the Safari 5 extensions that developers have cooked up in one day or less uh, because Safari 5 was released yesterday and not everyone knew about it and so forth. And I found this one page it's on uh, safariextensions.tumblr.com and you have a lot a lot of uh, you have a few not a lot but you have a few um, a few extensions here for example uh, puny URL which basically um, takes the current URL uh, that's shown here and uh, will puny puny punize it I don't know uh, punify, punify. There you go. Punify it and make it smaller. So that's just one one extension. I've installed another extension called um, I think it's Gmail checker or email checker. Uh, it primarily works with Gmail. So I click on it and it brings me to my Gmail page. This little um, badge here tells me how many messages I have. I have six messages um, and I can go ahead and mark all of them as red and do what I need to. Uh, thanks guys for watching this video. You can find other repositories. I'll give you a few links. Um, not here, but I'll give you a few links in the description box or checks below for a few links to a few repositories I found on the web where you can install Safari extensions. But before I go, um, how do you enable extensions? Because Apple has um, kind of locked it, uh, so uh, it's not enabled by default. And what you really want to do is go to Safari and Preferences and go to, ex uh, not extent, okay, go to Advanced and Show Develop Menu and Menu Bar. And then, then you can, this Develop Menu here will pop up. You click on it and you go click enable extensions. Once this check mark is next to enable extensions, you got enabled, you can um, add, remove, change, you can update, blah, 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 with all these um, extensions here. And you can also get updates to the, to the extensions um, as well. I just got the email uh, on my mail. And you can choose update interval, 15 seconds, a minute, um, turn them on and off, uninstall, enable. Uh, so yeah. Uh, if you want to drag something onto the toolbar, which if it's an icon or wh whatever it would be, just go to uh, View and Customize Toolbar, and it allows you to, if you, for example, you have uh, Gmail, I can drag this Gmail, you know, wherever I want. I can change its uh, place, you know, um, on my on my toolbar. Uh, thanks, guys, for watching the video. Please follow me on Twitter. I'm on twittercom code. and also follow my Facebook, facebookcom code. And thanks guys for not, uh, for watching this video and check back soon.